go ahead and toss things over to meteorologist Jim Lytle with the latest. Yeah, Jim, will we see any more snow here for the mountains? Yeah, the mountains are going to get more snow on uh, Wednesday, it looks like. And then over the weekend, too, another system coming our way. But wasn't today a great day? It was just so perfect. Blue skies, sunshine, 59 degrees is our current reading right now. I wouldn't be surprised if we made 60 for the actual high today. We'll see if that comes out at the end when the... uh, Climate summary comes out. West Northwest breeze has uh, been a little brisket, but it's dying down somewhat. Visible satellite imagery showing clear skies. The dark color represents clear sky. And uh, you can see the mountains keeping the cloud cover off to our northwest, helping us with the sunshine that we have out there right now. So, real nice day. Tomorrow will be nice too, actually. High pressure is going to continue to dominate. There will be a lot of sunshine, but in the afternoon, some clouds will start popping up because of this system coming in from the northwest. Tomorrow, our high temperature will be 53, so a little cooler. Lots of sun, but clouds in the afternoon. Here's that system. It comes barreling out of the Great Lakes and develops into a low-pressure system off the coast. It just pulls down a nice little chunk of cold air. It's not going to lock in, but this pattern is going to produce mountain snows and rain for us on uh, Wednesday morning. And this is what the models are producing for snow for the mountains. Four to three to eight, something like that, uh, three to six inches of snow coming up for the mountains with the system on Wednesday. So, again, we're just supposed to get rain here. And it's fast moving. It doesn't lock in. We're not going to have cold air for the rest of the week. In fact, it warms back up again after Wednesday. Wednesday will be one of the chillier days coming up for the work week. 37 right now up in the mountains. It's 59 here. We talked about 59 Lancaster. A lot of 50s showing up. And again, it's a real nice day. Not much wind. It's starting to die down a little bit. Radar is showing no precipitation. We'll take you up higher and show you nothing coming in from the northwest either. This is where we're going to watch this frontal boundary that's already starting to form up in Minnesota. That's what's going to race to the south and southeast toward us and give us this rain that we're expecting during the day on Wednesday in the morning in particular. Here's our future cast talking about 50s. This is for uh, tomorrow. Uh, Tuesday looks like a nice day, dry, a lot of sunshine. And then look what comes up later on in the forecast. There's rain coming up for Wednesday morning, snow in the mountains. This is where they're getting that three to six inches of snow uh, from this system that comes. It's fast moving, so it'll be in and out of here Wednesday morning and then out by the afternoon. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if we had a little sunshine toward the end of the day on Wednesday. That's how fast moving it is. But it is going to produce a little pocket of cold air right over us, and there'll be a cold rain for us, mountain snows, and kind of a gloomy start to the day, certainly, on our Wednesday. Well, let's take a look at the mountain forecast. we got uh, snow for you all. You'll have snow on the day on Wednesday with mostly cloudy skies. And for our seven-day forecast, goes like this. We've got temperatures that will drop off quite a bit for the weekend. That's the second system we're watching. That's going to drop our highs to the 40s. And the cool day on Wednesday will be chilly, but it warms back up after that. And then we got more weather to watch. Snow coming up for the weekend in the mountains once again in our extended forecast, guys.